South Carolina's Republican primary is tomorrow. Polls show former President Donald Trump with a large lead over Nikki Haley in her home state. But as Erica Brown reports, the former South Carolina governor is vowing to stay in the race no matter what tomorrow's outcome. Former South Carolina Governor Nikki Haley is making her final pitch to voters before the state's Republican presidential primary Saturday. So now we have a decision to make. Do we want more of the same or do we want to go in a new direction? Polls show she trails former President Trump by more than 30 points in her home state, but has vowed to stay in the race, arguing she has a better chance than Trump of defeating President Biden in November. Donald Trump cannot win a general election. Trump focused on a potential rematch with President Biden, not the Republican primary, as he rallied supporters in Tennessee Thursday. The restoration of law and justice in America begins with firing crooked Joe Biden on November 5th, 2024. If we don't fire him, our country, I believe, is doomed. And Nikki Haley's supporters tell CBS News they believe she should stay in the race as an alternative to Donald Trump, who is facing a series of legal challenges this election year. Many South Carolina voters we spoke to have their minds made up, but not all. I think Trump's got it in the bag and she's, uh, she's wasting her time. <laughs> she's a smart lady. She works hard. I really have not made a full decision on who I'm going to vote for on Saturday. But a recent CBS News poll finds most Republican primary voters in South Carolina are firmly supporting one candidate. Erica Brown, CBS News, Washington. President Biden easily won South Carolina's Democratic primary earlier this month. Democrats have their next primary on Tuesday in Michigan.